you live in the north, it's definitely time to winterize your RV. I'll tell you how to do that in 60 seconds. Number one, drain your fresh water tank and open up your low point valves wherever they are to drain most of the water out of your RV. Number two, take this plug out of your hot water tank or wherever your plug is for your hot water tank and drain it completely. And also bypass the hot water tank. You do not want antifreeze going through your hot water tank. Number three, if you have any filter cartridges like this inside your RV, they need to be removed also. Number four, set your valves correctly to winterize. Number five, you're gonna use this hose to draw up the antifreeze from the bottle into your fresh water system. On my fresh water intake, if you notice, there's a conical shaped washer that needs to be flipped around so that it's pressing inward. When you got your antifreeze ready to go in the RV, if you put it on a platform about two feet off the ground, it really helps to get that antifreeze flowing. Number seven, turn on your water pump to begin the flow of antifreeze into your RV. Number eight, you wanna turn on the faucets one at a time, both hot and cold. Number nine, when you're done running your antifreeze through your faucets inside, don't forget the outside shower. If all else fails, use this hand pump. Um, I got one of these last year when I returned from Florida. My, my water pump died and I had to get it winterized. This did the job, so nice to have. Hope that was helpful to get your RV winterized. Happy camping.